Senator Vic Bianchini is a retired judge who has laid down the gavel and picked up the saber and has proved in the sport of fencing it's never too late to get started. Oh. This is a very mental game. And Vic Bianchini is talking about fencing, the sport he was introduced to, you might say, a little bit later in life. I'm 77 years old, so I started at the age of 72. So life begins at age 72. <laughs> And while he says it took about six months to fully understand the sport, he soon excelled to the top of his class. I qualified for the world championship in the first year and a half that I fenced, and I won the national championship after fencing only two years. This is an age group thing, so this was the age group of 70 to 79. Vic currently trains at the Golden Saber Academy in San Marcos, where he fences against opponents just a tad bit younger than he is. I could actually literally be the great-grandfather of some of these uh, kids that I fence. And by the way, make no mistake, they are terrific fencers. And at age 77, don't think Vic Bianchini is even close to slowing down. So my goal is to try to get an 80s division started so that, that I can keep fencing past the age of uh, 79. And I bet he will. The key to his success, he says he spent 31 years in the uh, Marine Corps. So it kind of kept him in good shape. He was also an avid tennis player as well. I actually took one of those right in the throat. So, oh, my yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't watching where I was going. He's smart for reinventing himself. He, yeah, reinventing yeah. himself. That's a tough Great sport, fencing. too. It, is, yeah. it really is. It, mental it, game. It's totally a mental game, mm -hmm. yeah. Maybe that's why you got stabbed in the That's throat. probably why I was in the wrong place at the wrong time. <laughs> yeah. All right, thanks.